eat it. I like spicy. Some asshole TIG welded the handlebars to the bike. I have a rough idea worked out now. Trying to find the best place possible. I cut the pedals and housing right off the bike frame. I left the kickstand mount bracket on to mount the housing on the new frame. I removed the pedal shaft and cut another of a different bike then TIG weld it on my shaft to extend it. Shaft for my pedals. So one pedal is good, the other pedal is extended so it reaches past the frame on the bike. Hopefully they're even. Um, so now I just gotta grind down about a half inch to a square. Ooh, that's still really hot. Nice TIG though. But yeah, grind down uh, uh, yeah, just a little slide in there, a bit of half inch. So far, so good. Okay, hey guys. So, um, this is what I had to do to mount my sprocket. This is a Shimano off a uh, Triumph. Um, I went through two rear sprockets to find one that had a big enough uh, opening to for the one way for my bolt to go through. So it might take a few tries to figure out which is which. So these are my spacers for the top. And then this is how I'm mounting my bottom. So as you can see, I ground it right down so that the center still catches. I have a nice plate to weld to. And then this is how it mounts to the rim. So I'm using just an old uh, V-belt. I think it's a V-belt. A couple of these suckers I had laying around. Um, old V-belt uh, piece for adjusting. Anyways, so that goes on, gets welded on there, like so, which will be tricky to weld, but I can do it. Um, I might grind uh, the outside gear off. Um, I'm thinking just remove the outer, uh, the one outer, and then I can weld it better. Hey, anyway, it's still working. I don't like that I heated it up a lot, but yeah, I got it all welded. Centered. 
Uh, so I'm just gonna clean up the back side here and then we're gonna get that outer ring welded onto the main. Uh, like so. I got it set so that it basically sits as soon as I can get it. Grind that. It's a little holes out. It's a big hole. A little victory dance. I dab the stud ends with paint, then transfer to sprocket, then center punch them and drill. I have to grind tabs for sprocket to sit flat. My bad camera angle is trying to show you where the engine mount tubes need to go. Welding my tubes to the motor with chain to get proper alignment. Making some minor changes for exhaust clearance. Okay, so there's my bottom I'm working on right now. Just getting, uh, tacking in a nice little piece to make it look nicer. Just an angle plate. The pedals, tire, and motor mounts complete. Now I just need a beast motor. Boom! Working it. Gotta work it, uh, let it work in a bit. I was actually gonna see if it actually drives, but I'm freaked out a little bit because I got no brakes. <laughs> It rides great. Stay tuned for the motor EP.2. Send it and save money.